back with another video. I say I'm back with another video. Make sure you hit that like button, comment, subscribe. Yes, I said subscribe. Turn on your post notifications. It's free. Do it for me. Let's get into it, man. Your boy Cam Newton. He was attacked at a 7v7 football tournament, football event. Um, he didn't have on football gear, so it don't look like he was playing. It was him and two guys. I'm talking about he was fighting both guys, and then another guy came and jumped in and punched on him. But he most definitely held his own. And it been no details of why this event happened. Why did this take place? But I will say this, man. Cam Newton is a well put together guy. Like he's the type of guy like he going to pop it, but he going to hold his composure. So the only thing I could probably think of. Hey, it was a football situation. Well, one of the guys probably say he'll do this, this, this on the field of Cam Newton. Cam Newton probably, you know, a competitive argument and it escalated that's the only thing i could think of because think about it just imagine a football star come to an event where you at you don't know this football star what possibly could happen to make you want to put your hands on this football star unless you an athlete yourself and we already know how them athlete conversations be going Man, you know I jam you up. I, man, I do this. I, hey, bro, you couldn't do none of that if I... Yeah, man, you crazy. You garbage. And then once all that go... Hey, it gets serious. But I must say, man, Cam Newton, he did hold his own. I can't play the video on YouTube, so I'm going to put the video on my Instagram. Make sure y'all tap in. Man, the homies know the truth, nigga. What niggas talking about? Tell him put the real footage out. Yeah, you'll hear about it. Stop the cap. <laughs> Next, we got your boy AD. Y'all remember AD from No Jumper? He was a co-host at No Jumper. He left him when he did his own thing. Man, it looked like AD was getting a brakes beat off him, man. But guess who came to save him? Guess who came to save him? The big and only crib. OT Genesis, man. OT Genesis grabbed a dude, put him in the headlock. But the dude still had a grip on AD, man. AD was on the ground. He pulling AD shirt off at the same time. He popping AD. AD trying to hit him back. Man, listen, AD, you lost 10 points from this one right here, man. AD, you talk all that noise. And see, this is why I say people don't fight and guess what i'm not even bashing ad like you know what i'm saying i'm not gonna say he lost a one or whatever the case may be i'm not bashing ad but i made this video right here especially this part because this why people don't fight this why people rather shoot because they don't want to get embarrassed you feel what i'm saying just imagine if ad beat the dude up and he just took a look Stumble and he fell and now the dude got the best on me then somebody go to family now the only piece of clip we seen is ad on the ground swinging his arms the dude standing up over him putting them haymakers on him and pulling his shirt but ot genesis got the other dude in the headlock but at the end of the day this clip it looked like ad lost you know what i'm saying ad would be made fun of because he supposed to be this big crib he talk a lot of noise like, it don't be no room for these type of guys to get embarrassed. And when they do, it be like the end of the world for them because they be done talk so much noise online. They be done make this image like they the big bad wolf online that you can't even slip. You can't even slip and the guy get started getting the best of you and people start filming and you gonna look like a chump. So man, hey, <laughs> this is an unfortunate situation for that boy AD, but I will say OT Genesis, saved him because if ot genesis went there putting dude in the headlock dude would have most definitely most definitely put the pause on ad worse than he did but y'all get in the comments and tell me what you think about this video as well i cannot play this video on youtube it will be on my instagram so make sure y'all tap in like comment subscribe turn on all post notifications it's free
Do it for me. Let's go. Promo alert. Promo alert. Promo alert. Today is your boy, GWK Quavon. Make sure you go check him out on YouTube, man. He just dropped one. It's called Too Easy. Go support the youngest. Y'all already know, man. The kids is the future. The link will be down in the comment section. Promo alert, promo alert, promo alert. Today is Miss V's. Man, make sure y'all go follow her on Instagram. Let me tell y'all something. When it comes to desserts in Los Angeles, California, Miss V's is the one that supply everybody. She got two locations. The first location is a pop-up table slash tent. It's on 36 and Crenshaw Boulevard, Curryside, outside a church parking lot structure in Los Angeles, California. The times is on Sundays, 11 a.m. to 1 p.m. Location 2, pop-up table slash tent near 3430 Slauson Boulevard, Curryside, between Nipsey Hustle Marathon and Woody's Barbecue in Los Angeles, California. The times... Tuesday through Saturday, 11 a.m. to 5 p.m. Listen, y'all want to make sure y'all go support Ms. V's, man. If you never had it, what is you doing? If you in Los Angeles, California right now and you never had Ms. V's desserts, you tweaking little phone now. Make sure you go subscribe to her Instagram. The link will be down in the comment section. It's so good. Let me try this control. Oh my god. It's not dry or anything. It is great. So I'm gonna have to send a picture that you Thank you guys. Let's put the spittle fall on the side. Oh no. I think it was gonna be I was in a hurry. <laughs> Apparently. Thank you, Miss V. Miss Valerie. We can now wait for you to become quiet. Hey, do me a favor. Look down right there to the bottom left and hit that like button for me. Hit that like button right there. I appreciate it. I continue watching. Y'all don't know, man. I'm helping people get monetized. If y'all don't know, man, I be behind the scenes. I be behind the scenes helping these new YouTubers get monetized, helping their channel grow. A lot of people you see I do promo for, I'm behind the scenes helping their channel grow. If you a small YouTuber, and you trying to get monetized. You need a thousand subscribers. You need 4,000 watch hours. Hit me up on Instagram at music101ceo. And we're going to get the business club, man. I'm going to put something right here, man. You can see this young lady right here. She put the work in. She listened to what I said. And she put the work in. And she got results. Quick as a mug. You hear me? Listen, I thought it was a glitch. I ain't gonna lie, she is the fastest growing YouTuber that I ever gave advice or help in my life, for real. Because a lot of y'all be procrastinating. It's a lot of YouTubers that I took under my wing and they not consistent. This young lady right here, she was consistent. I told her I did, I gave her some tips in less than a week, less than a week, her numbers tripled. Her numbers triple. A month later, she monetized. Man, listen. If you're trying to win, hit me up on Instagram. Music 101. See yo. Every day you. Every day you wake up, you need to promote your company. Every day you wake up, you need to promote your brand. A lot of people don't like to pay for promotion. Well, guess what? You need to turn into a promoting guru. Marketing is the number one key to success. A lot of people is not making it in life when it comes to company businesses or music or talent, whatever it is, the product you're selling, whatever it is, because not enough people have seen or know you exist. You can have the best product in the world. You can be the best rapper in the world. You can have the best company in the world. But if we don't know you exist, how can we engage? 
You need to put it in their face every day. You post it every day. I don't care if you get one like, post it again, post it again, post it again. They either go unfollow you or they go engage. If I see something come across my phone five, six times, I'm going to eventually tap on it to see what it's about. Marketing, promoting is the key to success. Y'all better get to it. Music 101. Alert! Promo alert! Listen, if you guys want promo, DM me on Instagram at Music 101 CEO. Music 101 CEO. I'm doing twenty dollar promo. For twenty dollars, you will get one video promoted on my YouTube channel. For forty dollars, I will promote three videos for you on my YouTube channel. Sixty dollars, I will promote six videos for you on my YouTube channel. And hundred and twenty dollars. I will promote 12 videos for you on my YouTube channel. You need YouTube promo? You trying to get your business up? You trying to run your numbers up? Hit me up at Music 101 CEO. Hey, you don't want to miss it. The results is great. Thank you, Music 101 CEO. Thank you, baby. We're on the road to 100K, and I need y'all help. All you got to do is hit that subscribe button. When you see my videos, hit that like button. It helped push my videos in the algorithm. It helped more people see my videos, and it also give me a chance to get more subscribers. Y'all already know I can't do it without y'all, man.